Welcome back to our ongoing Office 365 series. <clears throat> I wanted to run an audit log. So basically we were talking today and they were saying, um, is it possible <clears throat> to see the activity in like you have a thousand of users using OneDrive. So you wanna know like blocking an EXE is enough, yes. But do you like, what if you have to search and um, like they were saying that you want to search what people have saved you are giving one terabyte and then five terabyte on eventually 25 terabyte so you don't actually want to go and see what they have uh, like go and click on files but what what if you like you have 100 users each five terabyte so you have like 500 terabyte or if you have thousand users 5000 terabyte how do you search that so <clears throat> this one like uh, it came up like uh, how to do that so i wanted to try it and uh i already ran one and then i did the e-discovery as well because i remember if you don't uh, remember or not uh, when we were doing the e-discovery for the mail we were not able to download the files and if i can show you here it was this one so i just ran it again uh, see the error so I then you know one thing led to another and I was remembering that I had the office uh, like trial expired and then I could not run this so I said why not try it with this one and see if I am able to download those reports because we never did that so let's just do that so let's in this video we're gonna do the audit log search and the next one is we gonna do the e-discovery for OneDrive only. So I, I, I've been playing around with this one a little bit. It's a lot, like folder activity, uh, file, page. So basically, if you remember, it's SharePoint and OneDrive is one. So you will see page or website and web page, all that. SharePoint list activities, you know. So it's a massive, massive uh, tool. And I went through it i cannot cover it in the video so you have to do it on your own uh, if you can create a home video uh, sorry a home lab or you can get the office 365 trial and play here if you want to so you see they, they even have somewhere deleted sites so it's a massive tool to search everything like audit and basically this one it says audit log search but what i went through it's basically all, everything that your users have done in Office 365, you can edit it or audit it. And you see Sway, I'm gonna learn this one as well. So I have a, like a few topics in my mind that uh, come up during discussion. So I'm gonna go learn them and then make videos. So groups, Azure AD, like, and <clears throat> Even it adds the e-discovery activities, like the searches you made in e-discovery, they will be saved and then through this audit, you can find them. What were they about? <clears throat> I want to learn this one as well. Somebody was talking about it and it got me you know, a little bit curious. Power. teams so teams is very very huge right now <clears throat> i don't know if you know or not if you're following it actively or not microsoft plans to add a wife uh, walkie talkie feature to teams so just like in like a walkie talkie you press button, push button and send a message and somebody gets notification like in real walkie talkie microsoft wants to implement that in teams the other thing is uh, at work, I was, you know, uh, I was wondering why my office, uh, sorry, Skype working over there and not in here. So I saw that Microsoft is actually terminating Skype for business for everybody next year in July. So we have like a, about, I would say, 17 months and some change for Skype for business. And it will be completely gone and everybody will be forced to implement Teams on there. So you see Teams right here, Teams activities it's huge so let's do the search on uh, it's uh since i uh, we are in onedrive i it's right here so <clears throat> i'm gonna just do who 
who were the user who uploaded uh, files because that's what we did right we did uh, for admin and for i think it was ali um or aslan aslan yes aslan aslan uploaded the file so we can either do assess file checkout file download file nobody downloaded uploaded files so since we are know these two we can see assessed because we logged into the accounts and then we saw the properties and then in the last video so let's do the very first one and where is the search button this is clear oh this is the drop down so if i click here yes so this one is the it's not giving me option to go back reason being that we started this one uh, the OneDrive it started implementing around 14th if you remember so we have only like four days uh, we're gonna work with that like if we had started it like in your organization it could be different like they might have done a year or two year back so you have the full full functionality so it start and uh, and it is pretty much same I could put like 15 I don't have to but you know because we have uh, we had not uh, activated it very long time ago so we have a very really short range we're gonna work with that there this is the user field like you can either target a specific user I don't want to because I don't have thousands of users I know the, who the, who were those users who uploaded so I'm gonna leave it blank and see if it shows gives me a list of everybody who uploaded uh, with thousands of users this will not be a good idea because everybody will be uploading and you just will be looking at them file folders or site add all or part of a file name so you can use the wildcard like the steric you can use the folder name again with the steric or a URL you can paint a uh, uh, SharePoint uh, uh, URL since we did not create any site or all that so I'm gonna just leave everything blank and see what I get here I'm gonna run the search it's loading I think I ran a site uh, search earlier all right so <clears throat> yep so we use the same computer so it's, it's the same IP uh, right here and this is the date yep they were done at this time maybe like uh, I make videos around 11 p.m. so it it could be yeah, 20, 10 20 27 around 10 27 right see and this one is next day 21 22 all right so whatever it's a video ah assessed file so this is not the uploaded file like who assessed accessed a file when so we can actually see the upload file as well maybe we get more uh, results here so run the search it says two it means it's gonna search uh, uh, run two searches let's see uploaded file access file access xx access so we can export the results save loaded result download all results so this six result found and between these and I selected two you see this tiny check mark these are being searched I'm gonna download all results and see what I get I don't see any notification of is there anything new alert policy new retention policy what is the alert policy send this alert when what happens activities access files upload files oh these two and by the user like you can set a user that if user is accessing a file or uploading a file send this alert to the recipient like an email address so this one is good let's uh, where's the X cancel button retention policy what's the retention name description record type what kind of record exchange admin item SharePoint blah 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 activities users who does this retention duration and priority so retention how long you want to keep it and <coughs> So basically if they were performing those action 
in any of these these are the activities upload like uh, upload clear suggestion there's no suggestions all right so if they're performing these activities by these user just uh, retain that activity as a log so, so let's exit out of here and SPMT setup so I'm not getting the save load result oh this is the save load result I'm gonna still save it and download all result. ah it says something uploaded to document slash Microsoft team chat files so it's been uploaded to my OneDrive so it's in OneDrive if we can go there um, onedrive.live.com It said something ch chat. Documents. So let's see one more time. Where is it saying? Document Microsoft Team chat files. Documents. One drive. So it says uploaded. Ah, no, this one is wrong. I'm looking at this one. So I need this one download all results and they are not being downloaded all right so <clears throat> i was looking up for the wrong thing sorry about that this was talking about this one and this is access from document c so this is different well anyway this is it for the audit log file um i'm gonna wrap this video here if this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and i will see you in the next one and i should cover all of these topics as well.